Welcome to another episode of Tim's Garage. Today we're talking turbos and this is my new favorite thing in the world. This is my Garrett Turbo, Garrett GDX 3071 or 7130, however you want to say it, turbo. This thing is way too powerful for me, but we're going to stick it on the car anyway and it's going to be a heap of fun. So this thing is, is just a huge step up from the standard KO4 that comes with the MPS on the 2.3 litre. And so this is going to give us huge, huge power. Way too much power for the stock engine, but we're going to detune that a little bit and we're going to detune this and it's going to work. What is really interesting about this turbo is it runs an external wastegate. And so what I'm going to explain is the way that a wastegate works. Basically the turbo has two parts, your exhaust part and your air into the car, so air out, air in. What will happen is your exhaust will come out of your engine through the exhaust manifold which will plug onto here. That spins a little turbine there and the exhaust gases come out what will be your dump pipe there, okay, and that comes out the back of the car. While that spins, that spins your turbine at the front which sucks in air, which is why it's bigger, sucks in more air, pushes it into the engine so you get more power. It's free power, that's why turbos are so good. This has, you can see it's been welded up. That would have been at some point an internal wastegate. What an internal wastegate would do is open to allow how much exhaust gases pass through this turbine. So as that would open, uh, if that's wide open, the exhaust gases just escape and it's all good. When it, when it closes, it forces more air, the exhaust gases, to come through the turbine, spinning that faster. And that, that controls the amount of gas that will turn this turbine, which therefore controls how much air or boost goes into your car. That's an important thing. So your exhaust manifold plugs onto there and controls what would be called the internal wastegate. Now this uses one of these, which is an external wastegate. Now this doesn't actually bolt onto your turbo at all, but that exhaust manifold becomes really important because when the way this works, this will bolt to your exhaust manifold and all your exhaust gases basically go through here. And when this um, shuts down, it forces the gases to go through your turbo. So this, using a diaphragm, which is in there with a the spring load, so we hear that in there if you tap it loud enough. Um, yeah, sets your pressure for your turbo boost. So this is a huge one um, because it's a big turbo. And that's what we're going to be putting on our car in a couple episodes time. So basically that's the way our turbo is going to work. We've got an external wastegate, a massive, massive turbo. And that's going to be cool. It's going to be, this is a real step up for what we've been doing on the car so far and this is really next level kind of modifications but um, this will be a lot of fun so stay tuned and we'll show you how we're going to fit this to the, the car in an episode in the next few weeks. Should be fun. Thanks for watching Tim's Garage. Subscribe! Please! Subscribe! Because that's what you're going to say on YouTube video. Seventy thirty one or something. I need to look that up because that just makes me look like an idiot. <laughs> I don't know what to. Oh god. GDX thirty seventy one. Oh, so close. I just sent them backwards because I'm dyslexic. <laughs>